What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Jujutsu Kaisen. I don't even know what episode. I'm just insanely sad we only have two episodes left. Like always, if you guys want the full uncut versions, check out that Patreon. Check out the social medias. We do have some Q&A questions like usual for JJK. If you guys don't know, I have a Discord where you guys can ask me any questions and I'll try to answer them before the episode they pertain to. First question comes from Simlinth, one of our question askers all the time. Much appreciated. He says... Uh, as JJK season two is coming to a close, do you think we get Gojo back in the season? If not, what do you think Fate Ghetto's plans are for sealed Gojo? Do you have any predictions for the next arc? What can be Fake Ghetto's motives? That's the one. That's a great question. First off, that's the one thing that I've wanted for the longest. Now that we know Ghetto is Fake Ghetto, as soon as I learned he was Ghetto, and that he's from an old, he's from. Uh, old JJK days like when he was say, talking to Mei Mei and he said that's not bad for a modern sorcerer we know during the they call it the golden age of sorcery shit was just on a different level so I don't have any predictions for what his motivations may be but I think it has something like the stakes of it are much bigger than current scenario you know like he's easily been the most manipulative the smartest the, like he's the plan maker right now and him sitting here in front of Yuji makes me insanely excited that we might finally get some answers i've been wanting them for so long great question though thank you oh almost all my predictions for next arc and is gojo getting out this season no gojo's not getting out this season and i think the next arc is going to be somewhat of like a recovery arc maybe the aftermath and then i do know the name of the next big like saga i know it's called the cooling games but other than that i don't know anything about it i just know we also uh i'm not gonna say what i know i know one very small thing all right, next question comes from Merc. He says, would you rather spend a day with Toto, but he calls you my brother every 30 seconds, or spend a day with Mei Mei, but she makes you pay for everything, and she is expensive. Not even remotely close, I'm choosing Toto. Don't get me wrong, Mei Mei is a very attractive woman, but she is only interested in money. Toto, it, like, he would die for me. He's a real one, if he calls me his brother, if he's my brother, but uh, that one's an easy question. Toto, all day, every day for me. Next question comes from Zawarudo, which I think is a um, JoJo's reference, right? He says, besides Sukuna and Gojo, who would you say is the strongest JJK character alive currently? It I don't know because I haven't had them scaled in a while, but to me personally, got to be my boy. Yuta is the goat and Yuta, when he eventually does come back and he's one of he's related to gojo he's a descendant of one of the three great apparitions of japan like even that as a title it's got to be that boy Yuta akotsu come on he's come on he's the go i cannot wait to see him again great question it just gets me even more excited to see him thank you so much like always thank you guys for the questions enough of the intro not gonna waste any more time let's hop right into today's episode all right here we go jujutsu kaisen the hole that was Shibuya. I love just the quietness right now. City. Oh. Is that Panda? Shokami. Yeah, okay. We don't know about Kusakabi yet, but Panda's alive. I'm taking any dub I can right now. Shokami. He's forcing gorilla mode, but that's his sword. That's not a good sign. Okay. Kusakabe, two dubs. I'll already take that. Show me Inumaki, show me Maki, show me... Yeah, that's Kusakabe's a realist. I mean, I have a feeling the higher-ups at JJK High are going to be insanely pissed. He's outright saying it. A little shock shocks me a little bit, I won't lie, but I get what he's saying to a certain extent. Okay, so we she is we're good. She knows. Sell any the Japanese stock market, everything is gonna crash. The GDP is gonna lower. Do we finally get to see Choso? Over here crying, thinking about his brothers. Yes. 
please, I hope you discover answers so then we could get answers. Me too. Now Yuri's like, fuck no, is Mahito gonna get saved again? I was of the opinion Ghetto, Fate Ghetto is not gonna save Mahito. Maybe absorb him, maybe kill him. Oh, that's horrifyingly scary. Now he jumps over the hole and he can just... The amount of, like he says, his versatility, the amount of options he has is literally endless. There's so much shit going on right now. Yeah. Is he gonna absorb him? Oh my god. And just like that. He hasn't necessarily been saved, but he's been contained. This is like worst case scenario. Oh, I love the way they animated that though. Him physically breaking down into that. I love the way they animate. He's gonna have to swallow it. Ooh. Oh, we have had that mentioned a couple of times. By your name? That what he did against Yuta? With that Rika on that last blast? I'm not entirely sure though. I love how it's called Uzumaki. いや、すまない。協力だが、呪霊操術の強みである手数の多さを捨てることになる。だから初めはあまり誘われなかったんだ。ハブドウェイダーですグローズ。呪霊のリサイクルだと思っていたからね。使用した時に起こる術式の抽
Wait a second. Are we trying to say fake Ghetto is Choso's dad, one of the ex... Like, he was the lead of the Camo clan back in the day, right? Known as one of the worst sorcerers in history? I'm, I'm rewinding that. The one who toyed with my mother mixed his blood in the mix. Camo Noritoshi. He's like, that's me. No, you're just named after him. The stain on the camel, the worst sorcerer in all history. Over 150 years old. Uraume? Bro, what the fuck is going on? When I said I wanted answers, <laughs> they gave me some fucking answers, but like now I have more questions. This is back when they were playing Life. Back when Nobara and Yuji killed his other brothers. I love that. That's a cool benefit of your power. They're even playing a remix of that song right here, bro. Beautiful. Now, is he just feeling that or is that true? Because we still don't know Yuji's origins. Dude, do we got Choso on our side now? He's like, yeah, I've been wanting you guys to meet for a long time. This is the potential you could be at. Oh my god. How is she catching that? I can't say she. I keep forgetting. Arame, the gender hasn't been confirmed. I love this song too, bro. This is a JJK classic. This animation is going crazy. I love seeing Choso fight. You got the fucking Manta Ray carrying him. This is not a fight that ever I would have expected on the cards, ever. Bring him down like a fucking hail fire of blood. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. Little jet propulsion action. Is that what an, a, a technique reflector? Ooh, clean. It really doesn't even look like fucking Ghetto's trying, though. He looks so smooth and seamless with it. Look at him. Choso's one of the best fighters we've seen. That is true. He did already have a crazy fight. I don't know what's going on, but I'm loving it. <laughs> they don't know what's going on. And I killed his brothers. Yes. Oh, they're ready to go and fight. I love these boys. Yes. Let's get Gojo back. Oh my. With Kusakabe too? Everyone. Oh my god. We got the Avengers versus fucking fake Ghetto. And Urame. Shimonagi. Okay, Haku, you mind chilling out? I didn't even mean that to be a pun. Piercing blood did go. Is. Oh, yeah, want to protect the vessel, obviously. This is crazy. This is crazy. He's like, stop being like Toto. What kind of preparations is Utahime doing? 
Oh, I love this animation. All right, Todoroki, chill out. Oh, she, he, she's about to kill everybody. Yuki? Bro, I'm gonna start crying, bro. What the fuck is this show? Oh! Oh my god. Yeah, if I actually, I might have to check my pants later. I might have actually busted. We're gonna be talking about this arc 50 years from now. Oh my god i am at a loss for words right now from no genuinely trying to process that mixed with also amazing animation fights core everything i finally got some of the answers i've been meaning i've been wanting motherfucking fake ghetto is choso's dad who is an ancestor who's the staying on the camo clan who we don't even know now at this point if that's because if it's camo he would have been like they said 150 years old minimum he could have been body swapping for much longer than that this okay 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 so choso and yuji might actually be brothers okay i like the only reason i say that is because we don't have yuji's parental heritage at all we don't know and right before Gramps was about to die in episode one, he was like, yo, about your parents. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, May May's alive. I need to see Yui Yui's technique. How the hell did he get them out of there? That's insane. She was able to recognize they were almost dead. We got Choso on our team temporarily even. I'll take that. We got more fucking Uraume with the Haku Todoroki powers going crazy right now. And then on top of that, we got Uzumaki. Mahito's gone. I completely forgot about Mahito. And then we have motherfucking Goat herself. The one who had the last conversation with real Ghetto put him on this path. The one who taught Toto everything he knows. Oh, fucking one of four special grade users. Motherfucking Yuki is here. Oh my God. And all that happened with amazing animation fights, reveals, moments, music. Like, we have one episode left. This season is going to be touted as one of the best anime seasons of all time. No hesitation, no doubt in my mind. I am shook. You guys saw those posters I got for One Piece and Hunter x Hunter? I need to get one for JJK. Like, it's confirmed amount of oh my god like i can't say hot takes i don't want to say a hot take but i just want to say like at least for new gens jjk is my favorite new gen for sure like blows me away consistently and now during editing i'm probably gonna during the comments i'm probably gonna let me know there's 10 hunter hunter references in there oh that was an episode i was hoping we have an episode of breathing and no craziness the exact opposite they said hey Fuck you, Darius. I said, okay, man. Okay, fuck me. So, absolutely incredible. Absolutely immaculate. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on this video. Let me know your thoughts down below. Oh my God. Have a great day, you guys. <laughs>